Hey guys, Mr. Wellness here with another Wellness 101 Quick Tip. I know things have been a little unsettling lately, so today, you got questions, we got answers. Your top 10 coronavirus COVID-19 questions answered right now. When will social distancing end? Now I know there's a lot of speculation about life getting back to normal, but the truth is, that's most likely not going to happen. Many doctors believe social distancing should stay in effect for the foreseeable future until more data can be obtained. Remember, we don't make the schedule. Unfortunately, the virus makes the schedule. The flu infects and kills more people than COVID-19. So why worry? True, nationwide, the flu has infected approximately 34 million people, and about 20,000 Americans have died since October. But the mortality rate from coronavirus is much higher than that of the flu, especially for the elderly and those with underlying conditions. Remember, this virus can be spread even when you're not showing symptoms. So to my young friends, think about your parents and your grandparents. What do I do if I think I'm sick? Stay home, isolate yourself from the rest of your family, and call your doctor to discuss your symptoms. Perhaps give a video visit a try. Most patients with coronavirus can recover at home. But if your symptoms increase dramatically, seek medical attention right away. Can coronavirus go through the skin? While it is possible to pick up the coronavirus by touching a surface that has the virus on it and then touching your nose, mouth, or eyes, more often than not, people are transmitting COVID-19 through respiratory droplets produced when a sick person coughs or sneezes. Can high or low temperatures kill COVID-19? In general, other coronaviruses survive for shorter periods of time at higher temperatures. However, according to the CDC, there's just not enough information on COVID-19 to give a definitive answer. Only time will tell. But the fact that this virus is still spreading rapidly in the Southern Hemisphere during its summer months suggests that it might not succumb to warmer temperatures. And sorry folks, drinking hot water or taking hot showers won't kill it either. If infected with coronavirus, can you survive? Yep. Absolutely, most people that come down with coronavirus survive. According to the CDC, the estimated death rate is approximately 2%, which is still much higher than the seasonal flu death rate of 0.1%. Should I avoid public transportation? Avoid public transportation if you can. Mass transit only increases your risk to coronavirus by exposing you to more people and possibly infected high-touch surface areas like railings and handles. If you must use public transportation, avoid touching your face and wash your hands before and after you ride to avoid infection. Can I get COVID-19 from packages? According to the World Health Organization, this is highly doubtful. Even though the coronavirus can stay on surfaces for a few hours or up to several days, it's very unlikely that the virus will remain on a surface after being moved and exposed to different conditions and temperatures. Can home remedies cure or prevent the coronavirus? Sorry, my friends. No amount of garlic, essential oils, or vitamin C have been proven effective in the fight against COVID-19. And please, spraying yourself with alcohol or chlorine will not get the job done either. Those products were great on surfaces, but can be dangerous to your body. What's the best way to prevent COVID-19? Practice social distancing, stay at least six feet away from others, and wash your hands as much as possible. If soap isn't available, hand sanitizer with at least 60% alcohol should do the trick. Folks, I know we're all a little anxious right now, and rightfully so. There are a lot of what ifs going around, but the key is to not panic and listen to our medical experts. The sooner we all do this, the sooner our normal way of life will return. Don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more Wellness 101.